Welcome back to Foulmouth Fishing. Um, this is a follow-up video to the original one I posted. Uh, if you don't know, I suggest I'll leave the link in the back to uh, see the previous video. But I am a longtime subscriber to the Mystery Tackle Boxes Elite um, boxes, their monthly subscription program. And I decided to open up this uh, YouTube channel to share some simple tips on how to fish, as well as easy ways to get the best baits similar to what Mystery Tackle Box can subscribe, uh, prescribe you when you have your subscription with them at a discount. So if you don't know, Mystery Tackle Box is a uh, subscription program. Every month you'll get a new box of baits uh, relative to that seasonal uh, fishing time period. So winter baits during the winter time, spring and summer baits during the spring and summer time, etc., etc. And they give you just a plethora of different baits to try. So some things you might never have expected to go to the store and buy or your local bait and tackle shop. Uh, if you're like me and you don't have a whole lot of bait and tackle shops nearby, this is a great alternative. It allows you to get bait and tackle uh, that you might not be able to get to if it wasn't for mail order. Um, but, like everything, it's a business and it needs to make a profit. They say that uh, you certainly get more in your box than you pay for. Well... Businesses don't stay afloat if they give away more than they make. So what I decided to do is do these unboxing shows uh, on YouTube and uh, create this channel to give you the experience of the unboxing with the twist of coming back with a follow-up video and showing baits that I can find that give you just as good a quality uh, or at least just as good a fishing experience, potentially, uh, for a lot less. So if you don't uh, subscribe to the Mystery Tackle Box program, you can still go out and hopefully use some of these uh, locations to your benefit to get the same baits that I get with my Elite package. So uh, we're going to start off first off on a little quick recap of what they gave me in the last box. Uh, I just picked out a few baits. I don't do that the terminal tackle because anybody can get hooks and things from their own personal uh, prescribed you know store what they like best. Uh, but what I did do is I did uh, Mystery Tackle Box had the Pursus 110. Um, this is a Genko bait. Uh, it's a 110 uh, suspending jerk bait. That was in my box for the January mystery tackle box. Uh, they had this Dobbins D blade spinning jig uh, with a nice little salt and pepper bottom, the white uh, skirt, double willow blade. They also had this Bagley flat side. Bolsa lipped diving bait, a shallow diver, and uh, just for kicks, they had these Lunker City Flukes. These are a, uh, they call it Blue Ice. It is a soft plastic fluke with the split rear tail, and uh, we'll just dive in to what I spend and what they promote it. So my, my subscription package is uh, $42.64 per month. That's with shipping, handling, taxes, and all. So I'm out $42.64 every single month, um, and they'll mail me one of these boxes. So the idea is I have to at least get $42 back in, in baits to make it you know worth my while. And that's what I want for everybody out there. So with the What's in the Box bait card, uh, which they subscribe, they prescribe or supply in each box. Um, you're going to see a value of sixty-three dollars and twenty-three cents in my personal video, in my personal box, uh, as they have it denoted for their uh, retail. What they say is their retail pricing. So we'll start off with the Bagley Bolsa. So they supplied this Bagley Bolsa uh, diving bait. They retail this. $10.99. So, with a little doing, and I try to use as many name brands as possible uh, when doing these, these comparisons, but uh, so I got a Strike King KVD. This is a one and a half diving three to five. Uh, the Bolsa Bagley is uh, similar diving depths, okay? So, this is a three foot uh, to four foot diver. And <clears throat> the KVD, as you can see, is the same size. Pretty much the same profile. I will say the KVD has a beveled 
exterior profile where the Bagley is obviously a flat sided. So your actions are going to be different. Um, there's going to be a, a much more tight wobble uh, action to the, to the flat bolsa and more of a lumbering wobble to the KVD when you're throwing them. But comparatively, they're, they're the same size, bait, and length, uh, similar profile and width, near identical colors, both are a red crawfish pattern, um, same black back, identical black spine. Uh, I actually like the red eye in the, uh, in the KVT a little bit better than this uh, silver outlaid uh, little tiny burgundy dot. There's a little more flash with the glitter and the red eye on the KVD. So this KVD was in Dick's Sporting Goods. Dick's is one of the few sporting goods uh, places I have around my house that I can get to easily. There is a um, there is a Bass Pro Shop here in Jersey in Atlantic City, but that's a that's a two hour drive for me, and I don't feel like driving two hours on a regular basis uh, just to get some some baits. Um, so the KVD came in at a whopping. Well, we'll go back to the Bagley. Bagley again. Ten ninety nine. Mystery Tackle Box Retail. KVD Strike King, six forty nine. That's a difference of four dollars and fifty cents, roughly. So you could save four dollars and fifty cents by buying a KVD at Dick's or certainly maybe Walmart, um, uh, Bass Pro Shops, wherever they sell the KVD uh, Strike King products. This one is um, uh, Delta Red. Um, it's a it's a KVD's again. It's it's the square bill crankbait. Um, so, $4.50 saved by buying a $6.50 bait over a $10.99 supplied in the box, as they say. So, we'll keep that to one side. That was a Dick's Sporting Goods. Um, the Pursuits, or Pursues, I should say. <laughs> so, I'll fix the other video uh, contributors. Pursues, um, a 110 bait, it's a jerk bait. Um, I did find similar colors, but they were a larger size at the same price as I got this. Uh, but um, I wanted to get as close to both the size, shape, and, and, and action as possible. And again, trying to keep within name brands. So the, the Pursues is a Jenko product, MTB listed at $9.99. Uh, it's a 110 millimeter half ounce jerkbait. I went to Walmart which I don't particularly care for, and they had a Rapala. Now this one is a little bit different in color. This is a, more of a, um, uh, a white pearl color from the Pursuits. This is more of a silver, uh, silver shiner with a light blue uh, back end. But same length, weight, description, triple treble hook, jerk bait, same uh, diving depths as the half ounce Pursuits. Pursuits came in again, $9.99 for the, for the Jenko. This Rapala Husky Jerk comes in at $6.96 from Walmart. So that's a difference of $3.03. So again, you're saving $3 back in your pocket. If you don't have this MTB box, you can go out to your local Walmart, see if they have this Rapala uh, size in, or you know the Rapala um, uh, Husky Jerk. You can get it in whatever color that you want to do to match your hatch. You don't necessarily have to get the pearl, obviously. Um, but there's another option for you, and it'll save you $3.03 over what I would be paying in my box. So you can get the same bait that I get from my package, go out and fish with, and it's only $6.96 to you. So that's another option. That was Walmart. Uh, again, um, <laughs> there was... I'll talk about this real quick. I particularly care for um, the combination of a willow leaf blade and a Colorado blade. I don't particularly care for double willow leaves, but uh, nevertheless, they they obviously they, they gave us this. Um, uh, what the hell brand was this? I'm trying to think. This was a Dobbins, I think. Yeah, I think it was a Dobbins D blade. Yeah, Dobbins D blade. Uh, it's a white skirt, uh, fish head jig, double willow leaf. As you can see there, with a salt and pepper, a uh, little add-on to the to the belly side of the of the jig skirt. So the Dobbins D blade they had in the box um, at 
their retail, $5.99. Now, that's a decent price. Um, but again, to be a frugal fisherman as I am, I try to find a better deal and the same basic idea. So again, while at Dick's, uh, picking up that, that KVD, uh, I came across double willow blade, salt and pepper skirt, same skirt, uh, same white. I actually like this fish head jig a little bit better. I like the eyes on it. Uh, they're a little more shimmer. Um, this is a Lunker City pro or yeah, excuse me, a Lunker Hunt product. So this is a Lunker Hunt Model SP1 spinner, double willow leaf blade. This one at Dick's Hardware or excuse me, Dick's uh, Fishing and Tackle was three dollars and ninety nine cents. Five ninety nine at MTB. Three ninety nine driving down to Dick's. Two dollars saved. Um, I'm not going to show you the alternate, but I'll give you. I'll list in the um, comments down below or in, in the description below. I'll list the uh, link to these two sites, uh, or at least to this this backwoods custom bait. So, Lunker City, those um, split tail flukes. They sell these Lunker Cities in the MTB box, and their retail uh, price is going to be four dollars ninety nine cents. It is an eight pack. Uh, it's what they call blue ice. It's a blue glitter top and a silver glitter uh, transparent-ish bottom. Um, eight pack. Again, they sell for four ninety nine. Well, I went online and uh, I looked around. I did find some similar, but not even close to the color pattern. Uh, most of them were, uh, you know, green pumpkins or red flake blues and and black black and red flake and some green and and chartreuse. And I wanted to try to get into exactly the right color. Not to say that those brands didn't have this color, but I could find closer uh, or some more similar um, patterns. But I went online to a, a little known uh, bait and tackle online site uh, called Backwoods Custom Baits. Uh, I'll leave the link in, in the description below. Uh, on their site, they have what's called a jerk shad. It goes for $4.19. So you got the Lunker City at $4.99 MTB retail. You've got the Backwoods Custom Baits at $4.19. Uh, they call it the Jerk Shad. It comes in a series of colors. Uh, most notably, they have um, uh, like a, a white bellied with a, a blue and silver uh, like back, which is kind of off, but they have a blue backed flake imitation of this that is almost, you know, it's, it's very comparable. It's not perfect, it's not exact, but it is, it is comparable. Um, those two, again, I will list ones, the Crystal Minnow, that's, their, uh, that's the silver and white, and then they have what's called the Tennessee Shad, which has that blue pattern to it. So the Tennessee Shad color is more, a little bit more you know, indicative of what the uh, Lunker City was selling. Uh, besides that, if you go to Bass Pro Shops, they have the Zoom 5-inch Super Fluke. The Zoom brand, obviously a name brand, everybody knows. Five inch, these are a four and a half inch, so it's a slightly larger fluke bait, but for a, you know, for a half an inch on your trailer, uh, on your jig head or whatever you're gonna do, uh, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do. But um, on BassProShops.com, if you go to a Bass Pro Shops near you and they have them in stock, the Zoom five inch super fluke in the silver fish color, which is almost perfectly identical to this. The same blue back, the same um, silver uh, fleck stomach with a little black peppering in there. Three dollars and sixty nine cents. Three dollars and sixty nine cents. A dollar thirty saved. All in all, taking these baits from the MTB box and the discount I save, I would have saved eleven dollars and eighty three cents just on these four baits alone. Eleven dollars and eighty three cents in my pocket as opposed to in MTV's pocket. That's another bait. So considering these things, when they when they put these retail cards, you gotta understand it doesn't matter what brand you're talking about, Lucky Tackle Box, uh, some of the, the northern tackle box companies that supply out of Canada, they're gonna inflate their retail prices. I mean that's just the name of the game. But I want to make sure that people out there know there's a way if you're put in a little bit of legwork Watch our videos, watch my unboxing videos when I get my MTBs each week, each month. And stay tuned and 
like, subscribe, hit the bell notifications so that you can catch those unboxings for the Elite Box, which is the highest rank that they sell. And go out and find comparable baits that what I can show you they're supplying to us on MTB and go find those baits so that you have the same opportunity to fish your local water hole with a bait a little bit cheaper or the same color and quality, same similar action, that you can get those fish on your pole just as easy as we can on ours. Um, thanks for tuning in. I want you to do me a favor, share this video, share the previous video of the unboxing that I posted a few days ago. Unfortunately, I'm sorry, I was a little late with making and posting this video. Uh, my mother had her birthday, we did a birthday party, and uh, work and life got in the way for a day or two. But uh, I intend to definitely get on a better schedule and keep posting videos more often and more frequent. Uh, at least once a week or twice a week, uh, certainly two times a month because I'm going to do these unboxings each month and I'm going to do the comparable follow-up of trying to find some baits over four or five days uh, from the unboxing video. I will find baits and uh, post that video so that you know some of the alternatives that I can at least uh, uh, shed some light on. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was or at least informational. Uh, I'm going to start doing some cast and catch videos when I can get out on the water, when the water warms up and the, uh, the fish bite comes back and the weather's a little bit more uh, pleasurable to fish because I'm more of a fair weather fisherman, not a foul weather fisherman. I'm a foul mouth fisherman, not a foul weather fisherman. But uh, as always, I appreciate it. Like this video, subscribe to my channel, hit that bell notification, and share. Share this video with as many fishing tutorial video places you know, uh, Facebook pages. I'll leave my, my Facebook link in the uh, description as well. And uh, happy fishing, good luck.